Hello and welcome. We are currently at the May Vinci Training Day um, at My London's Hotel. I believe. That's correct. Um, it's very swanky, I have to admit, slightly fish out of water. Um, but what we've done is steal Dave Kendall of Roots UK over uh, to do a little interview for us. Uh, and he's very kindly agreed to do it. We didn't tie him up or anything. Um, so, David, um, tell me, how long have you been um, running Roots in the UK? Uh, I've been group as 10 years this year. 10 years? Yes. Yeah. And uh, David is, you're Milton Keynes based, aren't you? Just outside Milton Keynes, yeah. But he's a really nice guy, so he's very approachable if you've got any group questions. In a roundabout kind of way. In a roundabout, hey! <laughs> um, so, um, in terms of what's happening, this is 2019, we're it's in February still, just. Yeah. Um, yeah, I heard, well I've, I've more than heard to be honest, I've got pictures, there is a new Rupes Bigfoot LHR15 Mark III coming out. That is correct. Now, as a man who used to have an LHR Mark II, mostly for decorative purposes, why would I want to get the Mark III? Mark III is obviously an updated version, um, so it's got, most importantly, the progressive trigger. Uh, the progressive trigger, so that means that so you can vary the speed as you pull the trigger. It also has the speed dial on the back, which is bigger than it was on the Mark II. Yes, it's, it's kind of like high vis, like the telephone bigger, is rolling. Yeah, bigger and, and, and larger, larger numbers. So you can preset the speed that you want to get to, and then you can vary the speed with the trigger. So if you've got delicate paint, yeah. that you need to know that you're not going to go above speed 4, for example, you can then vary the speed with the trigger. And the way that works, I think, correct me if I'm wrong, is in, in some sort of cheaper machines, you turn it and all it's doing is restricting the movement of the trigger. Yeah. But this one, even if you set it to speed 3, say, yeah. you've still got full... You can go 0 to 100% within the speed. Up speed within that range, it. which makes it nice and just. So basically, squeeze if you want to go faster. Exactly. exactly. Which is you know, a good principle in life, yeah, as well absolutely. as machine polishing. Um, and there are some other uh, changes to it, aren't there? Yeah. So, so the styling of the body itself, they've got the two rubber rubber uh, stops on, on the back of the machine, so when you place it on the on a surface, you're not damaging the tool. That's when you place it upside down. Yeah. yeah. And the styling of the body now matches the LH19 rotary yep. and the Mille gear-driven machine. So all the branding across the Rupert's range now all looks the same. Uh, so ultimately, see. when you have them on the wall, on the one hand, they all look very similar and cool and yeah. complied, and they've all got that kind of carbon. And, and when you say have them on the wall, we've all also launched the new wall bracket to mount all your Rupes tools on. That would be well. interesting. Now how's that bracket work? Is it kind of one bracket? Tape? It's a small plastic bracket, okay. about that big, and it just screws to the wall but it's got the cut out so you can just hook your machine on and hook your cable And it doesn't put any pressure on the back plate or anything like that? Correct. That's brilliant. And are they ruinously expensive? No. Brilliant. Do you know how much they are? No. Okay. <laughs> so they may or may not be ruinously expensive, but they'll be very handy. No, they're, they're about... 30 something euros. So that's yeah, kind of yeah that's yeah. equivalent to, to other kind of ones on the market. And um, so as I say, it's got the faux carbon fibre look, which I think is kind of cool. Yep. Um, and the only issue you're going to have, of course, is when they all look the same and you're grabbing them on, on, on the wall exactly. identifying them. Exactly. So what I suggest you do is give your machines names, like I give my cars names, yep. and my tiddlywigs. Um, and that way you know which one's which. Exactly. Cool, so we've got the, uh, the new shape body, we've got the speed control and trigger, yep. um, and also I've been told by a chap called Matt, who many in the trade will also know, who's, who's just slightly out of shot, um, trying to get out of his restraints, and he said that it has a 9 metre cable. This is correct. Now with a 9 metre cable, you can, you can do a lot with 9 metre You cable. can go around the whole car, pretty you much. You can go around the whole car. And you can tie somebody up. Yes, you can. Yeah, that's why we did it. Precisely, yeah. Now, um, in terms of other news, I heard uh, along the grapevine, Specifically, when you told me five minutes ago yes. that there will be a Rupert seminar in May, yes. similar to now we, we attended and it's on our YouTube channel uh, the iBox in Coventry, where you had a full shebang. You had uh, Jason Rose over, yes. you had James Walker from Wales, yes. you had Alan Medcraft came down yes. from Scotland, um, you had Torben from yes. somewhere Scandinavian, possibly Denmark, Denmark. Yep. Denmark. Um, and is that going to be a replay? You can have a team? It's going to be exactly the same as that, and possibly have a guy called Fabrizio. Oh. Over from Italy. from Italy, from Milan. And is uh, Fabrizio the engineer? Fabrizio is a train, one of our training managers. Um, so he's the European version of Jason Rose. Um, gotcha. Very highly qualified. Um, very intelligent guy. Uh, yeah, really, really good. Good, good knowledge. Cool. Okie okay, okay. And that's going to happen in May. Do you think it's going to be at the iBox again? Or something uh, we're looking at different venues because we want to try and get a, a few more attendees this year. Okay. Uh, so maybe 100, 150 people. Wow. Uh, so we need to find 
in the location that we can sit those people down but have both a practical session, classroom session, uh, with some virtues as well. So, um, but it, yeah, somewhere similar. Somewhere similar, that's cool. And um, last time I think it was about 75 quid or 100 quid or something to go. It's going to be, yeah, similar, 100 pounds probably. Yeah, pounds, which is really good value for the amount of training and expertise that you've got. Um, I mean, hell, you know, when you've got Jason Rose, Torben, and everyone else, Rizzo, yeah, yeah. in a room together, that, that, it's that's worth, yeah, it's worth, worth it just for half an hour. Yeah. And you get to meet David. Yeah, especially. Which is great. And he gives free hugs as well. I do. If you use good the keyword, I love my Mark III, yeah. he'll do anything you want. Yeah, it's true. Um, it is true. <laughs> um, the other thing is Waxdog. You were telling me Waxdog show, so that is yeah. in July. We've booked our stand. Uh, we're going to go bigger than we have done previously, um, and hopefully people will see a bit of a difference on, on our presentation. Um, we're hoping to have a vehicle on the stand uh, that's yes. going to be a little bit different to what you might expect. I've, I've, I've been told what this vehicle might be, and it is going to be a little bit different. It'll be quite fun. Yeah. yeah. Um, and you'll be able to basically, you've apparently even go in the back of the vehicle. You can if you're tied up in the boot. Yes. Yes. But it, it, there might be some special videos that you there can watch in the back. <laughs> yes, exactly. So, and, and I'm not kidding. This is this is real. Um, now, another thing was said. Um, you, you were getting terribly excited about microfiber pads. Tell me about your new yes, microfiber pads. Yes, we've redesigned the microfiber pads. As some of you may know, the old microfiber pads had the fluted holes in for ventilation yep. on a polyurethane backing. We've now changed the backing to a foam and got away with the holes. So, okay. so, uh, it's, so it's a completely, the heat completely new product now. That's good. Um, and they're available in um, multiple sizes or am I going to make uh, Yes, various different sizes are available. Brilliant, brilliant. And then the rotary, you said there is a new wool pad. There rotary. is a new formulation of wool pad, especially for rotary. And when you say a new formulation of wool pad, is this, have you been breeding special sheep? We it? have. Uh, we and have the, uh, the Italian sheep, which yeah. have got white and blue coats, uh, which are. That's really it's useful. useful. That's, that's the colour scheme you're using. It, it, is, it is. That is really useful. So to actually breed have... sheep. Yeah. Specifically to wipe them over cars, I think is, it shows the dedication that Rupert has. Absolutely, had. absolutely. Um, indeed. And that one, I'm told, is available in three sizes. And you were saying how you know what sizes there are that's available. Yes, they do. They do indeed. <laughs> um, so the answer is, I believe that's going to be that's going to be a six and a seven inch. I'm, 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 we've yeah. got Matt in the corner here, so fountain of knowledge. Do you know how, how many inches? I do know how many inches. Yes. Yeah. Oh, you want to know? I would love to know. Oh, okay, very safe. Oh. He does know, he's using his brain, otherwise known as Google. Um, so in terms of the seminar, what do people need to do to get onto your seminar? Right, well as soon as we've got the venue booked, we will obviously publish the dates, um, and then it will be a process to book online um, mm -hmm. and get your secured seat. Yeah. And when do you think, what's the time to go? Uh, within the next couple of weeks. Next couple of weeks, yeah, I've got to get it booked. A big trick is to follow the Rupes UK Facebook page, because that's where Dave will communicate uh, with, with with the people and we'll also let PVD know and we'll come so I'll put it in, in our group for all PVD members um, I'll make sure that we uh, we get a couple of days extra notice perhaps um, so that we can get on there uh, and Matt's making noises yes so 165 mil 165 mil is one of the options 150 mil 150 mil is the other option and, so 125. and 125 mil can you give me that in uh, in inches so four inches oh, no sorry I'm next so four four inch Five inch and six inch. Uh, there we go. Got it from the man himself. Yeah. Um, and and um, they are sorry. Reminder. So that's for rotary wall for the rotary wall wall pads. Yeah. yeah. Brilliant. Okay, Koki. Okay. Well, look. I know we need to get downstairs and show people how to use machine polishes and yeah. stuff like that. Um, but thank you so much for taking no the time to come up here. Thank you, um, and hopefully, hopefully we shall meet again at the seminar I'm and we sure can do we a little video um, and we can hook up then. Excellent. Pleasure. Thanks, Bert. Cheers. Cheers.